We started off with our project here in 2016, something like a pilot project for mangrove restoration. Eh? So uh, here in the village, we don't bother about the mangrove and all that. As the uh, awareness comes, we, we've been interested in. So we ask for nursery, we plant the uh, mangroves and uh, and uh, the NGOs of Caesarea came in and helped us a lot. When we came here in 2016, there hasn't been any seawall at all. And uh, the village has been complaining about uh, seawater inundation, surplusing the high water mark, the normal high water mark at that time. At that time, we were looking for communities, wonderful communities where we can do our implementation of mangrove rehabilitation. And we found out that uh, River is a perfect place as a nature-based solution. We have been blessed because we didn't know. We didn't know. As I mentioned before, we didn't know about uh, the importance of women groves. We just come, cut, go, cut, go. And as an awareness comes and uh, keep on awareness and we know the importance of women groves, that is the thing we really we appreciate the uh, Kiwan Institute, SUN and C3 been helping us, providing all this, and uh, for us to meet the target, 20,000. <laughs> The current project that we're trying to implement is to rehabilitate the coastal site. I've heard from some of the village elders over here that things were not seen here before this, it started to come back. Yeah? So that's a, that's a positive of, uh, response from them. Mother, <laughs> Sandra, I'm going to go to the 